everyone, this is Angie at Stampin' with Amore and today I have a card tutorial to share with you and it's this little birthday card and um, the original idea I cased from Stampin' Up so this is the background part but I actually stepped it up and added this little balloon with the string and the happy birthday so this is what I'm sharing today so let's get started I actually made this in a workshop that I had recently and this was one of the um, cards that we made so what you're going to need for this is you're going to need a card base which is five and a quarter uh, five and a half by four and a quarter and then you're going to need another piece that's five and a quarter by four and this is what our, we'll stamp on and then what the other piece you'll need is just to stamp uh, the extra balloon on. So let me go ahead and fold our base in half. And I'm going to grab some pool party. And the stamp set we're using for this is in our occasions catalog and it's this balloon celebration. And we're using the larger balloon for this. This is a really great birthday stamp set. So we'll hit this paper everything is pool party so it all coordinates together so how we're going to do this background the first thing I'm going to do is ink up my balloon and I'm going to do one that's dark and it's in the center and then we're I'm just going to start stamping um, some other lighter so I'll stamp on off and then I'll stamp some lighter and darker different variations of the same color and I'm just overlapping them all because it looks super cute to overlap them like they're all floating in the air that one a little bit darker okay so I think that's it and you don't have to do this doesn't have to be perfect um, it just looks really cute that they're all stamped overlapping and so this one I'm gonna just take I call these the little bubbles but I don't know um, exactly what there are but they make the balloon look more realistic so what we're gonna do is stamp that up and we're only gonna use that part I'm gonna stamp down here and we're only going to use that part and we're going to punch that out for our other balloon. Okay, so I'll just go ahead and this is our balloon punch that coordinates with this and I'm going to just put that in there and punch him out and save the other little balloon because you can use that for another card. And then with this one I am going to use my um, two-way glue and I'm just gonna put it all where those little like bubbles are hopefully I'm gonna get this thing going really good <laughs> there we go and then I'm gonna use some of our dazzling diamonds glitter and we are gonna put it on here just to give a little bit of dazzle to the balloon so pretty all right so I'm going to grab some basic black and we are going to put our string on and I love this little string that goes on it it said let us celebrate and it's just really cute this is also in that stamp set and I'm going to line it up here with that middle balloon isn't that adorable? And then I'm going to do the happy birthday down in the corner here. And I hope I'm getting it all straight because I don't want to get my head in the video. Yeah, that's good. And we're going to go ahead, before we add the balloon, is we're going to attach this with some snail to our card base. I'm 
like that. I'm going to get a dimensional and I'm going to add it to the back of the balloon. And we're going to pop that up right above the string there. And then the last but not least is I'm going to add a little um, rhinestone to the dot that the eye in birthday. And it just adds a little. Come on. These are sticky on the back, so it wants to stay on my little tweezers here. And so there you have it. It's so easy to do, and it's really a cute birthday card. So if you need any of the supplies um, for this project, you can go to stampingwithamore.com. And I always list all the supplies for my projects that I share on my blog. And you can shop right from my blog. So everyone have a blessed day, and I will catch you in the next video. Bye.